Hey guys, welcome back to my channel! Wow, that was a lot. Ugh, and there's so much and there's, mm, wow, that's all over. Mm, okay. Let's start over. Oh. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's definitely been a second, a minute, a month, a year, seven years, a century since I posted a video from my last video, which is my Fenty video. Yeah, I don't know, like life's just been really doing me. That's really all I can say. Life has been doing me and college is a real thing and I'm really here in college but i haven't been colleging um i brought to you guys this really really short video short tutorial on this smoky green emerald look um i'm not going anywhere but um i just wanted to play with makeup i just wanted to play with makeup and i wanted to record for you guys so um yeah i hope you guys enjoy this look and uh yeah i'll see you guys in my next video so disclaimer, I've already done my face makeup. Honestly, I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. Like I was already doing my makeup to go somewhere and then I was like, I should probably film this. And then I was like, nah. And then I was like, I haven't posted in like a month and a half. And then I was like, yeah, I probably should. So my face makeup is already done. I already highlighted, already contoured. I put slight highlight on today i didn't really feel like doing a big shebang but yeah let's just get into our eyes first so i'm going to take my tarte shape tape concealer and i'm just going to apply that as my concealer apply that as my concealer as it's my concealer i'm going to apply this as basically my primer or my eye base i'm going for a um like a dark green fall look I feel like um, everything that I'm doing, like within like the season, is like fall look. I'm like I'm going for a dark blue smoky eye fall look. I don't know. It's not even. It doesn't even have to be fall themed. I just put fall right underneath it or right next to it. Um. So yeah, I'm just gonna blend this out. Prepare for my beat. <laughs> I'm acting very obnoxious today. So I'm gonna use this like light green. It's not even light green, it's more of like a, honestly, it looks like poop. <laughs> it's this yellow green, like, it's not like, I don't even know how to describe it, but I'll put the picture up here. I'm gonna use this color, really packing it on, and I'm gonna use this right above my crease. I'm actually gonna take this yellow color. This is from Morve, and add that right on top of the previous color and just blend that out together. I'm gonna do the same on my other eye. Now in my 3-5S palette from Morphe, I'm gonna take this forest green. It's just this really dark green shade. And I'm gonna pop that on 
the outer of my eye. And first I'm just tapping in the color, trying to just build it up. And I'm gonna do the same thing, but I'm gonna put it on the inner corner of my eye. And because I want the eye to just look a little bit darker, I'm going to take black that's in the same exact palette and I'll pop that right on top of the green. So I'm going to take that previous brush that we used to do that light green and I'm going to take this and I'm just going to start blending it out now. Now I'm just gonna go back in with that green and that black together again, and I'm just gonna add a little more color and blend that out together. So the next up what I'm gonna do is I'm going to just take a flat brush and spray this flat brush with just my rose water spray or you can put setting spray or just any type of water that you want. And I'm going to take this like metallic-y green that's in the same palette. I'm gonna just pop that color right in the middle. Next up, I'm gonna take this Urban Decay Shadow or Single Shadow in the color Lounge and I'm going to top this color right above that green that we just did. And I, this is one of my favorite shadows. Okay, it's getting messy so we're gonna go in and clean that up later. And now I'm going to take my Stilla shadow in vintage black gold i'm just going to tap that with my finger because it works best with your finger and i'm just going to add some glitter right in the middle i'm going to take a more tapered brush like this and i'm going to go back in with that green and that black and just like clean it up So I was trying to decide on whether or not I wanted to do a winged liner but because this is so dramatic and I just kind of like want the entire face to just be like focusing on my eyes I'm not gonna do a winged liner I'm just gonna stop it at the end So now I'm gonna take these lashes that need to be thrown away, but because I don't know where I got them or like what the style is, I refuse to do so. So we're gonna pop it back on her eye. Before my lips, I'm gonna just take this dark brown lip liner and line my lips. This is from e.l.f. And then I'm gonna take one of my favorites from NYX Lip Cream, and this is Abu Dhabi. The camera really 
doesn't do it justice. So instead I'm going to take um, this lip stain from Sephora and the name is definitely wiped off. Um, and I'm just gonna put that on top. Yo, I'm disgusted. 